Hey guys, in this video, um, I want to go ahead and show you how to just uh, input and find the point of intersection using, um, you know, this is Desmo.com. So this is from 2018. You want to go ahead and just plug in the the function. So I think one of the parts is uh, part um, part B or C is asking for R of T set equal to 0 0.7. So R of T, I just put in my function, 44, and then I use X instead of T. And I put X over 100 to the third power, then 1 minus... Um, and you can see um, I did a the screenshots here video and but to do the fraction you just got to put the division bar and then um, everything else pretty self-explanatory you don't have to put y equals but you can the only problem with this one it was kind of funky looking um, I did, really didn't like it uh, other functions are pretty much more obvious so if you're having trouble with the uh, with the solver this is a pretty good uh, way to do it and then the second function you're just gonna put set y equals to 0 0.7 Okay, and then after that, you're going to have the two lines, and you can, you know, uh, zoom out with your fingers. Um, I use it on my phone, and then you just kind of click wherever you think they intersect. It doesn't have to be precise, and it'll actually give you the point of intersection, all right? And again, this one's kind of tricky um, because the lines are kind of, uh, kind of really close to each other, and they're not really uh, giving you much. But if you go ahead and uh, zoom out, and then click just wherever you can go ahead and and find out where uh, where they intersect okay so if you take a close look you can see the green line and the blue line almost intersecting to a point and then you'll see right now where I just go ahead and click you see there's the gray dot and then that's the first point 33.013 and so that's good because that was one of the points right and then the other one is same thing um, 166.57 and again, this this one I really didn't like. It's just a funky looking thing. I wish it would make it a little bit more obvious, but in this case, it didn't. You can zoom in, zoom out. Um, so it's not too bad. I really like Desmos. It's it's user friendly, efficient. And so this year, since you, um, they're allowing you to use other other um, notes and materials, you can actually, if you're having trouble with the calculator, use it to graph to find your points of intersection. All right, so that's very useful. Alright guys, so hopefully this helps and um, you can see them going again. Alright, and you don't have to be precise where you click because it will show it to you. Alright guys, see you guys next time.